Hey guys, how's it going? I'm uh, I'm here in the Mondrian Hotel in Doha, and we're about to check out uh, the Morimoto restaurant. Cool looking uh, hotel. We need to go to the M floor, but. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to find the floor because there's no buttons in this elevator. Why is it going up? Man, this hotel is weird. How do I like go down? No, I think I have to take these. Oh, this is an Car? interesting mm -hmm. elevator. So, anyway, until we get to the restaurant, let me just give you a little bit of background information. Car E. Uh, I'm stuck. Click the floor. Car E. Oh, okay. Why does it say 99? I better not go to 99. I hope that, I don't even know if there's a 99 floor. Let's just see what happens. There's like a TV in case you're stuck forever. So this restaurant is meant to be like uh, Nobu's competitor, I think. We are at the restaurant's floor. There it is. There's the restaurant. It's not a placement. I have this sushi bar plate. This is the decor of the restaurant. They bring you this little hot towel and the menu. I've actually never uh, vlogged in a restaurant before. It actually feels really awkward. And I think everyone's looking at me and I don't even have a mic. We're gonna do this anyway. Just thought I'd add. These are pretty comfy bar stools. You don't usually get this comfy. You have the whole cushion, whole package. How they make the food like it's art. I'm not even sure what that's supposed to be. That sauce is delicious and the crab is super tender and juicy. As you can see, I haven't even touched the lemon because it's perfect. And they gave this salad, I forgot what he said, papaya salad with nuts or something. In case I, I find it too spicy, but obviously I don't. So, no need. This papaya salad, it's actually kind of weird. I don't like it. I don't recommend eating it. Just eat the crab. That's a king crab. I think I definitely need to get more confident with the camera in public. Uh, I just feel too awkward. While we wait for the sushi, we can look at what else they have here. Rock oysters, uh, lobster. Alright guys, there's the sushi, these are the salmon Philadelphia rolls, the sake nigiri and uh, this is I think called negatoro or something, it has uh, basically toro uh, fatty tuna and uh, some greens and seaweed on the outside. Alright guys, let's try out my favorite which is the sake nigiri, of course first we cleanse our palate. Good. Next stop, 
We're trying the Toro thingy. The Toro is chopped, it's not like a, a whole chunk of it. I don't usually like the rolls with the seaweed on the outside, like the futomaki thing. I mean, it's fine. The toro is good though. I just don't like the outside seaweed, but I got it anyway. But yeah, it's fine. It's not bad. This is nice though. For the last type of sushi, we try the salmon Philadelphia with some salmon roe on top. Something in there is like a bit hard to bite. But I don't know what it is. It must be the avocado. Let's do a dissection. Alright, so we have one that's already like broken, so I wanna see if the avocado is oh no, the avocado is soft. So I don't know what it is this tomato? I don't know, I think it's this. Whatever this is, this thing is like I don't know what it is. It's salmon, yeah. I don't know why it feels like hard. Maybe it's like smoked or seared. Honestly guys, the crab was really good, but the sushi is like kind of average. Like it's good, but it's nothing crazy, you know? I usually don't order dessert because I'm not much of a sweet tooth, but they gave these chocolate truffles for free. like their waiting lounge. This is when you go in and out. It all looks like rose gold or something. You see? So let's, I don't know how this works. Now we hope that it takes us to the ground floor. Maybe when it reaches G, I'm just gonna press open. It just opens immediately. Well, it looks like uh, th this this chair is like soundproofing. It's like sitting in a studio. I can hear like my voice echo around. Me. My lips are still uh, brown from the chocolate. Anyway, in conclusion, the sushi was okay. The crab was amazing, and the service was excellent. The service was the best thing. And Nobu's sushi is a bit better, you know. But Nobu's other dishes, many of them are like meh, you know? One more thing guys, just a tip in general. If you're at a restaurant and you want to order sushi and you're not sure about which sushi to order, then the safest option is to just go for the nigiri. The nigiri like is always good anywhere. It's the rolls that you experiment with and then sometimes they're good and sometimes they're not. So yeah. So I guess if you want sushi, go to Nobu. If you want normal dishes, then maybe come here. And that's all for now guys. And hopefully I'll see you at the next restaurant.